forgot who I lost to. And... Definitely someone. It was de it definitely had to be a person. It, w it definitely was a team of two people. Hopefully. I, I, I would hope it's not one person and a bot. <laughs> I did I that last week, and thankfully I didn't take any sets. That would have hurt. I wanted to do that. I wanted to do that shine. Just no team partner. Just me and level You're nine. You're to do that, aren't you? I, yeah. I forgot that it's allowed to be. I want to see like a top player do that and see how far they go. I got that from the boss because the boss had to do that once. You did? I think the boss at a tournament smash four had to do that once. Hey man, well, when you main Rosa and Olimar, uh, sometimes yeah. the friends are not a plenty. No, I'm kidding, <laughs> kidding, I'm kidding, kidding, I'm kidding. Um, don't sue me, the buzz. Thanks. <laughs> oh, I'll pair. I mean, there's definitely some characters that just people just would rather not. Especially, uh, we have Sharp on stream. Sharp gives me a lot of uh, esports for um, for playing Sonic. He plays Wolf though. Yeah. I, I feel like there, there are some characters where you're not allowed to complain about anything. Yeah, I I, I'm like... inkling. I don't complain about anything. <laughs> there's dumb bosses shit in this game. Nope, oh, esports. Uh, <laughs> there's dumb, stupid stuff in this game. But I got like four moves that just invalidate half the cast. And yeah, and I mean, like, who cares about balls? Like, I, I was playing um, last week, I had to play splash damage because it was the winner between you and him. Yeah. And me and him lived until like 200% because both of our That's characters can't kill. That's that matchup. Either Sonic plays aggressive as heck and it's like even ish, or you both play like weenies and it's even ish. Oh, we played like weenies, dude. We were, we were not Sharp's running each other. Or not sharp. Uh, splash is a lot more of a passive inkling. Yeah. Uh, and in the inkling archetype. I think the most passive inkling is probably like. Probably him, in our region at least. Maybe Bobby. I haven't seen Bobby's inkling too too much. Would you say you're very aggro when you play? I'm, I think I'm the most aggro one in this region. Well, you got back air. Back but is like. That's why I busted. <laughs> <laughs> you got like. An I think at least it's like somewhere like. Like 75% aggro, but still a little like the right amount of patient. Just from playing Unleashed, I feel like. He's like he's patient until he gets the hit, and then he goes hard. Well, he gets a jab. I don't know why inkling players when they get a jab, they just turn up for no reason. Yeah, because it sends you into tech. Yeah, but like and then have fun being in tech chase versus inkling when she has the movement. <laughs> Here comes hero, and I'm gonna tell him. Oh, it's not hero, but hey, what's happening, blue? Would you like to commentate? No. Oh, okay. Fair. The streamer just get paid. The streamer just get paid, or you just do it to do it. Yo, shout out to Bell and Blue for running the stream right now so that way we can present our local to you guys. Yep. And yep. That's two yep. Oh, one <laughs> See, we're gonna have this uh, DK and Olimar, I'm guessing, versus. Um... I'm gonna be honest with you. What's up? Of all the teams in uh, this doubles bracket, it was a stacked doubles bracket, by the way. Oh, I know. I didn't expect either of these guys in grand at all. Mario. Especially the winner's side. Especially I, the winner's side. I, I could have seen I saw Sharp and Lil Dan. I was like... I could have seen them in losers. I expected Kraftus in uh, Delta. True. Or even Kraftus like, has been trying secondary. Like, so you can keep in mind. So they're going to undoubtedly lose a game. And Kraftus Delta is super reliant on like how turn Kraftus is playing at that time. Not to say that Kraftus carries... I mean, he does a little, let's be honest. Delta's not BR. Kraftus is any BR. It's like, I got carried by Alicia a little today, and then I got some swap on. But, but like, it, it's all reliant on how much grabs can you, you can get. But enough about them. More about Grand Finals. We're in it. Game 1 on FD. Corneria. Uh, love Star Fox, my favorite series. Not actually, but the characters are fun. Uh, <laughs> you know, Ooh, Blaze going for his signature. You know, Star Wolf is my favorite video game. That's why I play Wolf. He's my, he's my favorite second character. Yeah. You, you missed it, but Lil Dan got a meaty forward smash read on to play. Scared the first dog. Hey, you got to uh, save five dollars. Use five dollars because everyone paid five dollars for the venue fee to, to get into doubles, and these four guys have been destroying everybody just to get to the point they're at right now. It's and des deserving so. I mean, like both teams have been playing super stellar in this tournament. Not, neither has had really like extreme good ping pong combos, but both of, both of their neutrals and their own respect have just been super tight. They they've left no opportunity for either team to like capitalize in any team play situations. Oh yeah, especially uh, it's not like Smash Four where everyone moves at one frame a second. Kind of hard to ping pong <laughs> people in this game. It's fun to ping pong people. Oh my god, it's so fun. I mean, only for doing it well, it's so easy to pick off that. Just, just double back here. Kind of. Not just double back air. Back air and me back air, slash an air, and then I'll release an air or a forward air. Generally. Air has like no knockback. Yeah. So. Oh my god, and all three of us in the, in the, uh, the stream room losing it off of that. 
down throw to forward air. The Mike's peak just as much as Lil Dan Stock does, and he goes down. Speaking of down, there goes Pilgrim getting spiked by Sharp. This game is intense right now. It's kind of crazy when you have a character, like a player as talented as Blaze, who has the knowledge to get all these spikes, because he's spiking like top players life. in our area. It's his life. If you remove spikes from this game, I don't think Blaze will play. He's, and he makes plays. Yo, it only makes sense now. Yep. But anyways, back to the You made the fun everyone was thinking of, but nobody was saying it. <laughs> but I just thought about it, so I feel kind of slow to the situation. No, that's fair, that's fair, that's fair. <laughs> but uh, this team has, this is what, what they're running, and it's kind of crazy, because uh, Sharp wants to edge guard everyone, and then Little Dan, if they don't get edge guard, will just die at 20. So. But yeah, stock of peace. Uh, Little Dan going to be leading his wall stock, and it's going to be a 1v2 right now. That, that, I think Dan staying alive was like the pivotal point of what could make them come back from this. Because it's like, he had so much rage with the Dario there. And it's like, if he stock tank, they were going to start choosing more aggressive options because it's the last stock. So people would people usually get a little more antsy on the last stock and choose dumb options. Just like that. Oh, yeah. um, they are both. Actually, no, I thought Pokemon had his teammate. Oh, never mind. That wasn't a dumb option. I was really just staring. <laughs> he really just looked at him. I heard plays laugh from the commentary too. <laughs> He's a very good player, but it's kind of hard when there's two people, especially. Uh, oh, but when you're making mistakes like that, it might be a little bit more feasible. Especially with a character like Lucina that can wall out both. Not wall out all of them. She can do a good job at keeping her distance versus either of these characters. And DK, a character that doesn't really able to, isn't really able to get in much. Koga only has a blue Pikmin out right now. Hey, you for that grab. You can tell. Oh, he shuffles it, but he gets blue back in his lineup. Yeah, get rid of that white. You definitely don't want white at this percent. You're not going to really be using that too much. Yep. And he's, lo he's looking for either grab or up airs. But he's doing a really good job of mixing it up. He's making sure that if Sharp is over-focusing on his Pikmin, he's going he's gonna to get punished for it. He's making all the focus go to, go to plays, which is going to be a stop taken as a result. Pilgrim just wasn't really helping out enough. You can't get off stage if you're if you're uh, Pilgrim right now, because Sharp's edge guards have been on point today. I, I feel a force match coming. I from, feel it. From Pilgrim. Yep. Here I comes three. One. Aww. I feel the raw of the beef from Sharp. I don't know why. I thought you were going to say from Pilgrim. I was like, that ain't, that ain't going to kill you. <laughs> yeah. That's going to kill, but it ain't going to kill the right person. Oh, and Ooh. the up air reading the jump. A lot of inklings. I mean inklings. Yeah. A lot of Olimars you see going for that. They're either going to run at you and grab or up air. But super solid stuff from the red team. Dick came one. Uh, almost through the 1v2. Sharp was playing super smart. Uh, playing uh, rather clean. And just was unable to kind of clutch it out. By the way, but Kevin, that is a myth. I've only seen this man play. I'm going Fox today. Really? All Fox? And, unless I lose game one. Or unless I lose a game. A lot of people trying to secondary Fox today. Fox is 0-2. Uh, I don't want a main inkling. <laughs> really? Yeah, when, well, when people play lame, it's so boring to play, I think. There's no way for me to zone break. Like, if, if, from from how I'm playing right now. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to work on my secondaries and then, like, on the side playing. Like, hey! But enough about Inkling, more about Incineroar and Pikachu. Come to Ultimania! <laughs> Come to Ultimania next week. Come to Ultimania. No, put that back Put that back real quick so I can advertise it. Come no, to yep. Ultimania, May 4th. Uh, Smash.gg slash Ultimania sign up. I think the early bird sign up ends tonight. So sign up now. But game 2, Yahoo! I'm going to advertise it. Yeah. <laughs> But put that on after game one, after game two though, so I can advertise that more properly. We got our man experiments. We'll talk more about Ultimatium after this. But right now, hey, we you have were the talking switch. about Inkling accidentally game one, and Dan said, "You know what? Here I come. Switch to a game two. I'm telling you, I got the third eye. I'm already predicting the next game. Mm -hmm. I didn't even know that he had an Inkling though. So yeah, Dan's been picking up Inkling a little bit recently. Uh, it, it's been, I think, a bit more serious than his Lucario. Like in terms of how much I've seen him play either of the characters, I think I've seen him play more." They played them, I've seen them play with Gar, yeah. yeah, I'm surprised he definitely switched too because uh, they won that first game. So I'm surprised he just maybe feeling a little uncomfortable, but he, he's losing the first knock out of all four of them. So, but he's gonna get that forward smash, gonna give Sharp that edge guard opportunity, which he's not gonna let go. But this DK, we got the edge guards. Oh, of course. we're in grand finals. Nothing like that's gonna slide. And Sharp, but, uh, bad timing. Maybe, yeah. maybe an SD will slide from Sharp's end. I was gonna hit Sharp. Dead. Dead. Dan's dead because he directional to try and tank. I was gonna hype him up, but no, he's just a uh, Oh, yo, he's a scrub. I'm like, <laughs> me and him will always roast each other, because I play Sonic, and he's just him. So, uh, this is gonna be submitted to the for fast game twos. <laughs> yeah. I will tell you that much. <laughs> when you have enough time to get the donations, the game is going so fast, dude. I mean, shoot see twice, and he's probably gonna be a third time he's playing that hard off stage. But that's part of the reason why he's been getting so many early kills, is he's busy going off stage, but. 
playing a little spaghetti right now. Uh, Place Pilgrim one game one by the way. Uh, at Mr. Blue. 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 Wrong game one. Pilgrim one game one. I'm glad you said that. All good. But yep. Uh, That's there's your the awareness. Yep. <laughs> I play Inkling and uh, he plays DK. Um, there goes Inkling. Yeah, you're good. Right. My, my Inkling. That's why I don't want to play Inkling. Because DK spikes you at that percent exactly. It's a true combo. It's not even a combo. Don't think about it. I hate you, Blaze. I hate you for going for that. Blaze is a jerk, I, I knew he w extremely wanted to kill off the side with up And I know he's probably going to go for it again. I mean, brave. Oh, that's not going to do it. That is? All right. I hate it. I, I hate but I also love it because it's so good. You go to the ultimate. Win. But while yeah. we're waiting in this game right now, we have Ultimatium next week in this venue on in Taunton, Mass. We're gonna be having a lot of good people here. We're gonna have, uh, I believe, Light and Mars are showing up. Dark Wizzy. Dark Wizzy. So if you have some free time and you're able to come down, swing by, get to meet some of us, get to come down and meet your local scene. Yep, and it's overclocked XPCG, so we are gonna be having Eduardo, uh, TMPR, some of you might know him as, uh, help run the event. So if you're looking for a good crossover event from two great New England venues, this is the place to do it. Yeah, and I was um I was just saying a stream really a lot of almost the best people in New England. Wrestling, we have a wrestling belt. For the we winter. do? Yes! Yo, I'm going the mad. The winner was a wrestling belt! I'm going mad. <laughs> you ain't gonna Alright. <laughs> we can shake right now with a billion to one odds. Neither of us are beating Mars or Light. Alright, you gotta point. Alright, back to this game. Neither three. of us are beating like the top like twenty seeds at that tournament. <laughs> you do got a point, you got a point. Actually maybe like top ten. But like you can believe. See that type of comp. Speaking of believe, I have no segue for the belief, so <laughs> into game three. <laughs> What's the brackets for today's singles? Uh, it's gonna run right after this, but Nightbot auto posts it, so you'll, you'll you'll be seeing it. But it's a uh, bcgsmash.challenge.com slash smash ultimate underscore four underscore twenty six underscore nineteen. Have fun typing that. What? Yeah, if you type bcg and smash, if you type bcg smash Google, the first thing to show up according to Blue. Shouts to Blue. See, Kevin believes. Yep. Hey, Lil Dambly is in these uh, forward airs. He's taking a lot of percent right now, I'll tell you that one. <laughs> and um, we didn't acknowledge it, but character change from both of them, uh, from Inkling and Lucina to Wolf oh. and Lucario. I only like two of the characters on the screen. Actually, I don't know, Lucario has some jig jiggity jank, <laughs> as they call it. He's, especially what they've been doing this whole time, is like, Sharp will just ledge drop the hell out of people, and then Lil Dan will get to 100% kill everyone. Kill. It, was, it was two new DI, but it's still kill. At 80, which is still a little crazy. But Nerf bash. <laughs> All right, I'm about to get off the commentary. Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> Jeopardy aside, uh, the team is doing a lot better this game. Uh, like, like the, the the wolf figure definitely helped out a lot. I think Lil Dan switching back to the card was correct. I, I think his inkling did all right, but it wasn't providing the necessarily like. Not random kill power, but like unexpected kill power. I think that's the right, the right word I'm looking for. Unexpected kill power that, that Red Team's gonna have to look out for. And it's, it's gonna make them have to respect uh, Lucario's like unexpected kill power, giving wolf options like that more viability. Which they're already great, as we see by the great back air thrown out by Sharp to kill Blaze there. And you gotta think how incredible it is. Um, Blaze and Pilgrim in uh, Losers, and they're, they haven't switched. They have, I don't think they've switched. They haven't switched, they haven't lost a game. They've just been running the same team, and you see Sharp and Little Dan, they've been having to switch a lot, but not these guys. These guys have been very consistent, running with their guns. I mean, yeah, I think, I, I don't know about plays, but Pilgrim Secondaries are, uh, they, they definitely play Super Smash Brothers. They, they play Smash. <laughs> they play Smash. <laughs> well, they play one of the 75 characters, oh. I think. Oh, that's unfortunate, yo. This Lord, and that's what they needed. Like, and Pilgrim's at 156, he holds onto the stock, plays, gets a plays, and... That's it. Like <laughs> I don't even want to play singles. <laughs> commentator right now. <laughs> oh my Commentary's god. Commentator's a good time. No, for real. I'm hoping I don't have to. I'm, I'm hoping I can commentate some singles before my round two. Okay. Well, it's been fun uh, talking to him. But he, oh, he left. Uh, I hope stock a beat. Oh lordy, this actually might potentially be a reset if Sharp isn't looking out for Dan right now. Oh, never mind, never mind, never mind. All right, it's one v two combo. DK one twenty three percent. Sharp needs to get one decent read. And it'd be if Place comes back here, he's, he's the best DK in the world. And think about the, the how much of a, an advantage Blue Team would have if they didn't keep SDing. They've been SDing a lot throughout this whole set. 
and it's been really costing them, yep. but not costing them that game. That was so safe. Keeping themselves in this winner's bracket. You're good, but I am better. You know what's keeping right now? This you have no segue for that. I really don't. I was just praying. I'm the master of bad segues. <laughs> See, you watch like you you, call, you see me commentating with Hero at any point. It's me trying to make a segue for almost any moment possible. <laughs> Just any situation. Speaking of segues, we're gonna ride over onto game five right now. Uh, speaking of ride over, can we get the Ultimania slide really quick? You should ride on over to Ultimania, <laughs> May, May 4th. Uh, it's, gonna Yo, next, right it's gonna be next week, early bird, early bird venue. Yeah, I love that early bird venue. Uh, and 24 hour uh, 24 hour venue as well. Ooh. Very important to mention. Uh, it, the early bird, early competitor venue that ends today includes the overnight. It's limited to 50 people. I think you're allowed to sleep here. And PCG, for those who are 21 plus, PCG has a bar. So if you are looking to get schmack faced Three, while you're playing Schmack two, Brothers, one, come do it here. Does anyone know what time that runs at? Like, as it's like the practice starts? Uh, yes, o'clock. Um, oh, okay, okay. onwards to game oh, four. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's cool. As the bracket starts, he goes, yes, o'clock. But, anyways. <laughs> Me, me not having the information for you, but me wanted to talk about game four. Oh yeah, of course. Going to this Ooh. game four and now getting that that dome. Yo, can we talk about how we down smash for a DK and he actually hit the all one? Hey man, I'm trying to think of something. I was trying to think like like a side girl pun, but I couldn't. I was gonna say side smash, but that's just another word for forward smash. Hey, but both are just safe because uh, thanks Sakurai. Uh, <laughs> um, Oh, I, you know what? Never mind. Never mind. He forward smash plays. Plays grabs him and killed him for it. I, I, I take everything. Back. Stop. Stop. Dude, I'm you just so did the surprised. same thing to two people. You just did the same thing to two people. These two people are in winner's side and they they can't tech the cargo bro. Bro, I I got red the first time. <laughs> he hit him off the bottom. He didn't even hit him off the side. I'm surprised that they they have no one's tech that as I've seen on stream yet. It's over. Oh, <laughs> plays the same. Please have a 40%. Yo, it's over, dog. <laughs> Just went for the forward air. Plays is, he's not really afraid to go for the crazy stuff. All he does is crazy stuff. He, he just down aired on sharp shield. Plays gonna get six stocks or win Evo. And his, his reaction will be the same. He'll be like, ah, oh, man, it was a lot of fun. I, I went with DK. I, I put him on stage and I went for spikes. I had a lot of good time. Same reaction. <laughs> no emotion in this man's soul except for I want to spike people with Donkey Kong. And... Weird off-stage interaction coming from Sharp and Pilgrim on the left side. You love the heavy memes though, they're very dedicated to the character. Right away was telling me too. If you play the heavies, you just wanna you just wanna inspire people to play your character. Especially what plays is doing right now. So heavies are so cool as a game. I'm really happy. For real, isn't there? It's okay roll. Okay roll. I'm happy he's bad. I, that's all I'll say. I can agree with that. I'm happy he's a bad character. That's that's a very agreeable thing. He's kinda he's fun to watch on the play. It's like, like the little Mac. It's like if Lil Mac was a good character, nobody would be having fun right now. For real, yeah. I'm happy they're both bad characters. They just call me. That's, that's really unfortunate. Well, I'm gonna commentate until the end of the game anyways. Uh, it'll be fine. Like they're not gonna DQ me. Yeah. Eight. Eight. Okay. After this set match, I'm gonna go. That shirt is godly, by the way. Oh, shout out to Dead Man Dill, by the way. <laughs> there's no, there's no camera. But there is Not a game yet. four right now happening between Plays and Pilgrim versus Lil Dan and Sharp. Speaking of segways, uh, we're gonna go to Ultimania with this one. Uh, <laughs> oh! <laughs> Stop! You can't segue my segue. Yeah. Oh. Um, <laughs> and what was that 171% blue team living until forever right now? And, and Plays actually died. This is looking like a game five situation. It's really unfortunate that I have to go play. Uh, my set. What do you have left? Uh, I have to play DJ Delta, so it's gonna be cool. But speaking of plays right now, Yo. 808, 808. Um, plays coming back with that share stock and just running a town on the blue team. Yeah, he's doing a really good job right now. No, yeah, he's doing All right. Well, <laughs> oh, yo. Oh no. oh, no, I didn't mean that, yo. You're, you're just getting natural segways. Oh, speaking of segways, please. Oh my god, please. Up. <laughs> Stop. <laughs> you, you got, we're in, we're in last hit, Big Top. <laughs> he has too much power. Blue has too much power. But you know who has too much power right now? DK. Don't do it. Please. Yo, keep that mouse yo, on that. Yo, slow down. If there's anyone on the red team that can bring it back, it's plays, and he's going to be making them with that, with that uh, DK bond. Because you gotta think about it. Pilgrim is gonna try to think about this very cognitively. Oh! Please, 
I don't care. I'm gonna be just swinging, and Please. you're gonna get hit by my stuff. Please has moments where he uses his brain and moments where he doesn't. That was the moment where he didn't. But, <laughs> but like, he mixes it up so. I'm <laughs> Ultimania. Uh, he mixes it up so well, and like I, I say, he doesn't use his brain, but. He uses his brain, but he's like, they're get, they're gonna think I'm gonna do a smart option, so I'm gonna just go for this forward air. Yeah, that's no, that's how he uses his brain. It's, no it's so smart. It. Well, but hey, thank you for commentating. I'll probably, I'll probably commentate with you fun. later. Oh, best facts, of luck. facts, facts. I'm gonna be commentating most of the day today. I'm going secondary, so I'm probably gonna lose early. Who are you going versus uh versus Luigi? They both are so bad. Like, well, Inkling sounds good. Whoa. Uh, can you keep track in case I get called? I should be playing Kraftus. Thank you. But you know we're gonna be playing right now. This game five of this grand finals. We got a little Dan and Sharp running the Ultimania. We got <laughs> we got the same stage that we had for game one, same character that we had for game four, and we're gonna see who's gonna take it. We're gonna have a reset, or we're gonna have a GG's and a handshake. But what? Score it's on two. I need to focus on Ultimania. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta plug it, man. You gotta plug it. For the 10 people watching, that's 10 more people when we get into our venue. But we also got... Oh, almost getting that. It's uh, a lot of tickets to do that. They go for the down air, just in case you tech. Who I think is gonna take it? I wanna see, for the people, I wanna say please. But I, I have a feeling that Sharp and Little Dan are gonna win. That that's my opinion. Sorry to get to that early. I was too busy. Uh, he should be right from the corner commentary. Oh, getting that nice forward smash, the forward smash combo. Oh my god, yo, please. Please just make it, please. I wonder how many times he would say that commentary. <laughs> please just. For real. He put them both off stage, and I didn't know it was possible until I saw a short play. He literally ledge traps both of them. And it's just incredible how he controls the ledge and makes sure that both of them don't come back. But he's also making sure he doesn't come back. Getting hit off the level. Don't know who did it. I'm going to pretend that I did, though. Let's see, uh, pretty even. I mean, slight advantage to the blue team because blue team or a rage. But, and little Dan, very good at running with rage. He just kind of runs a town on you. Oh, not even let his teammate have the opportunity to get stuck in that situation and taking them out. But he's going to have to share stock. Nice 0% basically on both of the red team. And they have to do something about Little Dan right now. Just little Dan, I'm about to upgrade to Big Dan if he does not. If, I don't know where I was going. <laughs> I'm by myself right now. This is <laughs> I'm just, Chippy got me all messed up. Is it really? Let's go. <laughs> Yo, shout out to Blue. Let's go. Hey, what's up, fellas? <laughs> I'm running the stream and commentating. Let's Blue can do it. it. Shout out to Blue. Oh, jeez. I've been in this situation before. Last hit, last stock, pretty much. It's terrifying. DK, you know. It's super it scary. Happened. Especially Sharp. Very good at this game. Very good at controlling the ledge. But I don't know if he's going to be very good at controlling plays right now. Oh, no. He is definitely not. He's going bananas out oh. here. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm good at this sometimes. We should go to Ultimania. <laughs> yeah, let's go to Ultimania, guys. <laughs> we'll see. Back air. Uh, Stefan say Sharp Strong Suit is the ledge trapping. Missing the ebb tilt. Rolling in. No one expects it. You should. But edge guarding uh, GK. Oh, getting that down there. Man. And your grand finals doubles champion, Little Dan and 